Hey guys, what is up? Just wanted to make a quick video on a new City of Tweak that was released and the name is Video Pain. It costs $2. It's definitely well worth it. And essentially what it does is when you're watching a video on YouTube, Twitch, Netflix, and I believe maybe even more services, uh, more information will be in the description. However, when you're watching a video on one of those services and you want to switch to another application, go back to your home screen, etc., what Video Pain allows you to do is pop out the video and a little window to uh, basically like multitask uh, something similar to what you may have seen on like a Samsung Galaxy S ad where your little uh, video is still playing while you're in a different application so obviously I'll show you uh, how it works because it's a lot easier to describe it in the video so the first thing you're need going to need to do is go into settings video pane and then activate it. You can use any activation uh, that Activator supports. For me, I have um, the option of double tapping the status bar. Uh, you can choose any one of the other options if you don't like that. So what we're going to be doing is uh, demoing it in YouTube. So just open up the YouTube application. If you don't have it, you can obviously download it from the App Store. So I'll just be picking the last video that we made so we don't get in any copyright trouble or whatnot. So here we have the iOS 7 Beta 5 features, which if you didn't, obviously you should see it. Anyways, you have the normal video playing right here, but when you double tap uh, the top bar, you'll see you have the video playing now in this little window. Now the window won't go away if you switch applications. So for instance, if we want to go into Twitter or whatnot while we're watching a video everything works perfectly you can move it around your screen uh, play it you can have it playing while you're uh, changing tabs etc if you hit the button on the other side you can pop it up to full uh, vision where you can uh, scroll through it and all the other options and that doesn't actually do it, it's the done button and then once you have the video right here you can just exit to make it go away so I thought this tweak was really cool really interesting it's made by Ryan Petrich which has made some uh, amazing stuff for the jailbreak community and that's pretty much it if you like this video hit the thumbs up if you want to win an iPod touch that we're probably going to be giving away in the next few videos make sure to leave a comment on this video and I'll see you guys later